Shout out to Supersonic X because I'm trying to get him to 1k subscribers. So anyway, let's start the video. Went to space in real life, Adventure Time, Desert Lands by Veilskin194. You already know who Beemo is. He's from Adventure Time, one of the most beloved characters. You already know. So let's see. Um, haven't been really checking out information about Adventure Time, Distant Lands, but mostly check about um, um, the Midnight Gospel, cause you know. So, but I mean, I am gonna watch the Adventure Time, Distant Lands. But anyway, let's see what did he mean by Bimo went to space in real life, because I actually never heard of this. Yeah. So yeah, stuff is a lot of scrap and it's fine. Well I thought he knew but I can't see that because I've been on detail on my rain cheese. Cartoon Network recently unveiled the very first teaser trailer for Adventure Time Distant Lands, and the hype train for its special episodes is chugging along pretty nicely. We okay, know guys, that I'm sorry, but I actually didn't. I actually didn't check the teaser trailer. It surrounds the little boy robot alone in space. It was, people it was probably most don't because the Gus, the, 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 the Midnight Gospel trailer came like out, so I actually the watched that first. Last July, and I didn't Cartoon Network made the sweep that Bimo would be going into space. Keep in mind, this was before the official reveal of Adventure Time Distant Lands, so everyone thought this was just something fun to celebrate one of the show's most beloved characters. The robot's launch into space was through a SpaceX rocket, and while there wasn't much information at the time, some clues mm -hmm. have surfaced that this very much connects to promotion for Distant Lands. Distant but in lands. order to figure out what's happening, we have to go to the origin of this. Who exactly made Bimo in real life? And that's where we get to Bob Herzberg. He made Herzberg. a complete replica of Adventure Time's Q robot, and over the years, new features have constantly been added. His YouTube Ooh. channel catalogs just how incredible and faithful this is to the character from the series, and it really feels like you're hanging out with Bimo. Look how cute this is! Just as an example, he can have a full conversation with the robot who understands what people are saying and can respond accordingly. What do homies do? Homies help homies, always. That's very nice. I need you to protect Finn. Oh. If anyone tries to hurt Finn, I would kill them. Voice actress Nikki Yang even contributed some original lines entirely for this project, which makes everything feel more realistic. Now that we have some background, it's time to dive into what exactly connects that looks awesome. to the awesome. The most recent videos on Bob's YouTube channel are about Astro Bimo, which is a version of the real life Bimo you know, just the one designed to go into space. These videos show Bimo hanging out in space alone while weird button things float by. Each of these has CN video on them, meaning that it's for some kind of promotion or project on Cartoon Network. As as far as I know, there hasn't been any mention of Astro Bimo on their official social media, other than this post, of course. So maybe they're waiting to use the videos in the future. This. This looks incredible! Now, considering all this went down before the public was even aware about Distant Lands and the special where Bimo's in space, it would make sense if the two are connected in some way. The only problem so far is showrunner Adam Muto's tweet. You might think Astro Bimo was a planned tie-in, but really, it was a lucky coincidence. Then again, oh. if we head to the comment section mm. of Bob's Laser Defense System video, a fan asks if this has any relation with the Bimo episode of Distant Lands. Possibly. Tune into the Distant Lands and see, smiley face. Okay, mm -hmm. the smiley is telling, Bob. But that means one of these guys isn't revealing the truth, now are they? So mm -hmm. right now, it's hard to figure out what's actually happening. If I had to make a personal guess, I'd say that Cartoon Arc will eventually use this footage as promotional material for the BMO special. I mean, that would make more sense than everything else. It's just so hard to see. Look at this. It's a coincidence. BMO could have gone into space awesome. in life, literally at any year before now. Adventure Time has been a thing since 2010. Why is it the same year that Distant Lands is announced that BMO goes? to space, I am going to be very confused and very sad if this is a coincidence. <laughs> but even in the sad chance that these events have no relation to each other in any way, it's still worth checking out what Bimo looks like in space, considering he's floating around as we speak, literally right now. When you tune into the first episode of Distant Lands and watch him on his adventures up there in the animated world, you can smile and realize that it's not completely fictional. That's pretty incredible. Hmm. But anyway, that's all for this video. Subscribe for more awesome cartoon videos. Give a thumbs up and comment below what you think. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.
I'm I'm really impressed with me Bimo. And Katsunara should actually, you know, sell that. Cause I don't like to buy it. I don't know. Just wow. Um so yeah, um we're just gonna have to wait and see this this have anything to do with the episodes or if Cartano is gonna use this to you know promote the show so we don't know yet so yeah so yeah that's it who gets your job please find one for the new video i'll see you next time bye